10 Celebrities Who Battled Dementia 1. Eddie Albert Albert had many performance credits to his name. Roman Holiday, Oklahoma, The Heartbreak Kid. But his most famous role was on Green Acres. Albert played Oliver Wendell Douglas. He was diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease in 1995. He died of pneumonia 10 years later, aged 99. 2. Charles Bronson Bronson was the epitome of manliness on screen. He appeared in 15 movies with his second wife Jill Ireland. After a hip replacement surgery in 1988, Bronson's health declined. He retired from the public eye. Diagnosed with Alzheimer's, he spent his later years in obscurity. Bronson died in 2003, aged 81. 3. Glenn Campbell Campbell was an all-around star in the 1960s and 1970s. His songs dominated the charts. His CBS show, The Glenn Campbell Good Time Hour, was a hit. Campbell released over 70 albums and sold 45 million records. In 2011, he announced he'd been diagnosed with Alzheimer's. His final tour was marred by his struggles with the disease. Campbell retired from the stage and died in 2017, aged 81. 4. Peter Falk Falk will forever be synonymous with Lieutenant Columbo. Columbo had an incredible run of 35 years. In 2008, five years after it ended, Falk revealed his Alzheimer's diagnosis. He died in 2011, aged 83. The cause of death was pneumonia, complicated by Alzheimer's. 5. Rita Hayworth Hayworth was a sex symbol of the 1940s. The media called her the love goddess. During World War II, she was the number one pinup girl for GIs. Hayworth was diagnosed with Alzheimer's in 1980. She was one of the first celebrities to reveal her diagnosis. The disease contributed to her death at 68 in 1987. 6. Ronald Reagan Reagan remained highly influential. After leaving office, he's still one of the highest-ranked U.S. presidents ever. But by the mid-1990s, he'd retreated from the public eye. Diagnosed with Alzheimer's, Reagan felt progressively worse. He died at the age of 93 in 2004, 10 years after being diagnosed. 7. Robin Williams Williams rose to fame by playing the alien on Mork and Mindy, but he grew to become one of the most respected artists. Williams was a great improviser and imitator. He's still regarded as one of the funniest comedians ever. Sadly, Williams was suffering from Lewy body dementia. The disease drove him to suicide in 2014 at the age of 63. 8. Malcolm Young Young was one of the original members of ACDC. The legendary guitarist stayed with the band till the end. Young had spent 41 years on stage before retiring in 2014. The reason was dementia. Despite receiving treatment, Malcolm died three years later, aged 64. 9. Etta James The legendary singer's later years were painful. Despite spending time in rehabs, she kept relapsing. In 2010, 71-year-old James was hospitalized. She was treated for an antibiotic-resistant infection. Her son admitted she'd been battling Alzheimer's for two years. A year later, James was diagnosed with leukemia. She died in early 2012, five days before her 74th birthday. 10. Bruce Willis Bruce Willis had been acting erratically for years. He was forgetful and barely acted in his recent movies. In 2022, he announced his decision to retire. Willis said he had a speaking disorder called aphasia. But in 2023, his family revealed the truth. Willis has frontotemporal dementia. This debilitating disease is incurable.